Y para terminar la cobertura de la presentación del Volkswagen Golf 2015, vamos a hablar un poco sobre los esfuerzos de mercadeo que van a tener para presentarlo aquí en Estados Unidos. Well, here at the end of the of the activities for the launch of the 2015 Volkswagen Golf with Amelia Feinherr Morrison. And uh, so, Amelia, first, thank you very much for bringing us here to San Francisco. Of course, it's a beautiful time to be in the Bay Area. Uh, you know, beautiful uh, weather, beautiful scenery. We're across the Bay Area, watching the scene, the city from here, and with all the new variants for the new Golf. So, we drove already all of them, uh, including the old ones, which is uh, very fun for me. I love that. They're part. a fun treat to have on site here. With and, us. and I understand you guys went out to buy those cars. I mean, from from former owners, huh? Yeah, we didn't have all of the generations, so we had to look around and find the best possible to have the full assortment. Well, it was great. So go ahead and, uh, and, and look for us on our uh, YouTube channel. We have a lot of video about those old cars. But uh, let's talk about the new one and the marketing effort. This car is going to launch, uh, I mean, it's going to go on sale pretty soon, and it's coming with some cool pr promotions from Volkswagen. Yeah, you know, the, the Golf and the GTI are such iconic hatchbacks. They really... Uh, bring to life so much energy and so much enthusiasm from from all generations but this new generation really takes it to the next level and so for GTI this year we looked at the demographic and looked at the car and it just was such a sweet spot we found a really great partnership with doing some advertising around the World Cup and being able to tie into such an iconic sporting event made so much sense for this car. So we are doing a pretty neat promotion around it with the integration into uh, a few different ad spots with a, a couple pretty famous soccer celebrities and um, we're really excited to see what happens. So something else to be, be uh, paying attention during the World Cup. It's Absolutely. like the Super Bowl, like you have to Absolutely. watch the ads too. It's huge. I mean, it really is the largest sporting event in the world. And so what better opportunity for us? Um, you know, we have a, a huge presence in Brazil anyway. And so to be able yeah. to kind of be a part of the game from afar and in the international field is really perfect. Yeah, and also Volkswagen is also has very close ties with uh, soccer in Wolfsburg first, in Puebla, in Mexico, everywhere, right? For many years, yeah, we've sponsored soccer throughout the world and it's it's a really tremendous partnership for us. So, uh, very cool things and I understand there's going to be another uh, part of the campaign is going to be like through in the digital uh, uh, world like you're going to have like some pretty cool stuff uh, celebrating golf, not goal. <laughs> <laughs> right, exactly. It's uh it's a pretty perfect tie-in to go from goal to golf. So, yeah. it works really sweetly and we will do a rollout both in broadcast and in the digital campaign. We are partnering with both ESPN and with Univision to do um, dual purpose content in both Spanish and yeah. English language. Excellent. And uh, I, I guess I understand that Andres Cantor, my, my friend and former uh, co-worker, is as part of that campaign, right? There's a famous goal. Uh, yeah. He will be. He'll have a he'll have a component in the campaign. Excellent. That's correct. Still so, to come, so you'll have to keep your eyes out for what that's all about. Your eyes and your ears. <laughs> yes, exactly. And then finally, I understand also that there's a, a cool promotion for the first 500 buyers of the new GTI. You got it. It's pretty neat. So what it is, is it's not the first 500 buyers of the GTI, but it's the first 500 people that register to um, with the intent to buy a GTI. They register to receive a GoPro, a custom GTI GoPro. And with that, we're encouraging the buyer of the GTI to pair it with their new GoPro that we give them to really develop some pretty unique content of their experiences behind the wheel um, and and post it and, and start an online kind of community of, of GTI fanatics. Yeah, excellent. And how it's, it's, it's incredible how things have changed huh? from the first generation 40 years ago, no internet, no YouTube, no GoPro or anything like that, to now that you give a camera to, to it's people. It's incredible. It's such a technologically advanced vehicle and it really is pushing the limits of a truly unique experience in the car. And so to be able to capture those experiences in a safe way um, and be able to share them with your friends and, you know, counterparts around the world it's a perfect integration excellent so uh, talking about uh, friends around the world i understand que tú hablas perfecto español a mí gracias me preocupo un poco por la gramática pero igual lo trato yeah uh, maybe i'll find uh, morrison de volkswagen así que muchas gracias otra vez por uh, estar aquí con, por traernos a san francisco al debut de la 
séptima generación de Volkswagen Golf. Gracias por venir. Gracias, chao. Este programa fue una producción de National Latino Broadcasting. Thank you.